Hey everybody, DJ Legion here. Um, gonna shoot another video of um, a really good recent vinyl score that I came across Thursday night. That's two nights ago now. Um, at the Half Price Books in Berkeley, California. Um, you know, half price... <laughs> Secondhand shops and thrift stores and, you know, Salvation Army, Goodwill, those kind of places when it comes to vinyl. 90% um, of the time, I'm unimpressed. It's just the usual stuff that you see everywhere you go, you know. There's Chuck Mangione and Barbra Streisand albums from the 70s. And one copy of Linda Ronstadt's Heart Like a Wheel. And um, <laughs> Andy Williams, uh, usually some Andy Williams, and some classical, some beat up classical, and uh, the uh, <laughs> apparently mandatory copy of the Dr. Shivago soundtrack that I guess is some like permit process to go through to open a thrift shop, and you, you have to show the city the copy of. Dr. Chicago that you're going to have for sale or something because they all have it. Uh, Carol King's Tapestry is another one. Anyway, so I'm usually unimpressed um, with those places. Um, Half Price Books is a little bit better, especially since vinyl has come, come back in vogue. They've been taking care of their vinyl uh, section a little better than they have in years past. So anyway, I'm flipping through. I only go there about... I don't know, three or four times a year, um, because it, despite the fact that all these places claim that the selection changes every day, I find that <laughs> the selection hardly changes month to month, uh, let alone every day. So I only go a few times a year to give it plenty of time for new stuff to come in and be processed. Anyway, I'm flipping through the stacks, and here it is. Dio, Killing the Dragon, picture disc, 2,500 made for the world, that's it. For the whole planet, only 2,500 are made. This one is 1069, number 1,069 of 2,500. I'll take it out of the plastic and give you a really good look at it here. You can see the artwork, very, very nice. And um, show you the back. Just has the song titles there and uh, some more artwork. Great stuff. Uh, this album was originally released in 2002. Um, and the picture disc here was issued in 2011 for Record Store Day. Um, I paid $29.95. You can see it there. Um, I just got off of eBay. There were seven copies for sale globally. Um, the cheapest was $34.95, and the most expensive was $81. Um, so most of them were going for about $50 a piece. And I think, I don't know, I think when it came out back in 2011, it was. Um, $34.95, I believe. So, anyway, it's great stuff. There you see the Record Story Day logo. So, one of only 2,500 made for the whole planet Earth. Um, stoked to have this. Uh, the sound quality is mediocre. Uh, that's part for the course with picture disc. They're made to look pretty and show off. Uh, they're not made to sound good. Um, but um, it's a great album. Um, big fan. I saw Dio on this tour. Um, he was on a triple bill. He opened the show. Uh, Deep Purple played after him. And the Scorpions played after them. Uh, so it was Deep Purple and the Scorpions and Dio. Dio opened, so he only played about 40 minutes. Um, I could have done without the Scorpions altogether, honestly, and had another... Another 45 minutes of Dio and another five, 45 minutes of Deep Purple. But, um, you know, that's the breaks. So it was the only time I actually got to see him perform live was on that on that show. 
So I'm glad I did now that he has since uh, passed away. They actually recorded one of those um, one of those shows on that tour. This is Dio Evil or Divine live in New York City. Uh, this was recorded on the Killing the Dragon tour back in 2002. Uh, great CD, has a few songs off the, the new album. And, of course, his stuff with uh, Rainbow and some Sabbath and some of his other hits. So it's a good CD. Every live album Dio's ever released is excellent. So anyway, I just wanted to show this off. Um, half price books, man. Who knew? <laughs> so I'm stoked to have it, and um, hope you guys enjoyed getting a look at it here. Maybe you'll find one. Like I said, they got it for sale uh, on eBay. There's seven copies available out of the uh, out of the 2,500. And Discogs might have some more. For all I know, I didn't check there. Anyway, if you like this video, you know what to do. Hit the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. If you did not like this video, leave a comment, hit the like button, and subscribe. And um, until I see you all again, turn up the music, turn down the drama. Everybody have a great day. I'll see you soon.